everyone. Welcome to Rainforest Explorers VBS Day 4 Crafts. Um, the first thing I want you to do is grab your craft card that'll tell you everything that you need and the directions. You grab that and we'll get started. The first thing I want to do is review our Bible verse for today. So in 2 Corinthians chapter 4 verse 7 it says, But we have this treasure in jars of clay to show that the surpassing power belongs to God and not to us. Okay, so let's get our supplies together. You need your yarn. You should have that in your supply bag. Your Jesus Heals Cross and markers. You can also use paint, colored pencils, whatever you prefer. So the first thing we're gonna do, it says you can wrap tape around one end, but ours is the shoelace yarn like this, so we are just going to use that and not take. So you're going to start at the bottom and push the yarn through. So we're going to start and push your yarn through the back of that first hole and then come around the bottom and go through like this. And you're always going to be going in the back. I'm just gonna keep going just like that. I got a little bit tangled here. I'm just gonna do that. I'm gonna go ahead and pull it all the way through here. Like this. Okay, so I've laced all of mine and now um, I'm gonna tie it off. And the lady that I'm gonna talk to you about today's lesson. The Bible lesson today tells us about 10 sick men. Jesus healed them. Many things were different then, but some things are still the same. There are still a lot of people that are sick especially with the, everything that's going on right now. We get sick, our family and friends get sick, and our bodies are not perfect, and we get hurt. Jesus care for, cares for us very much, and he blesses us with doctors and medicine and, and bandages to help us. But it is God alone who has the power to heal. He sent his only son, Jesus, to heal us from sickness of sin by dying on the cross. Today, while we lace up this cross, um, it says some very important words on it. Can you tell me what it says? It says, your faith has made you well. Jesus makes us well from our sin by dying on the cross for us. He gives us faith in him and we are well. So next time you're sick or you're hurt, remember to trust in Jesus and thank him for his mercy. Okay, so I have this little tail hanging here. So I'm just gonna take some scissors and cut that off, and then we're gonna decorate our cross, however you want to. Okay, so I just cut my little tail off, so it just looks like this. And now I'm gonna color. You can color whatever color you want to. And um, I'm gonna do mine purple and blue like the picture, but feel free to get creative, okay?
Okay, so here's my finished product. I decided to just leave the middle of mine blank and do a little design around it um, so that I could clearly see these words that are the main attraction of our craft. So I want you to remember that when you get sick or someone you love gets sick, that we pray for them and have faith. We also have to have faith though um, that God's will is um, the right thing and that we pray that His will be done in all things. That's something that I struggle with for sure when I'm praying. So I try to just add that into my prayers and say, you know, we pray for this and that and we pray that um, everyone would be healthy and that God's will be done. Okay, okay let's review our take home point for today. Rainforest Explorers, Jesus is full of healing. And you say, Jesus is full of healing, Jesus leads the way. Great job. I hope you enjoyed today's craft and I will see you tomorrow.